You don't need to be a brilliant mathematician to use and create work in Excel, but you need a basic understanding of maths. Excel uses standard maths operators or symbols in its basic calculations. So we use a plus sign to add, a minus sign to subtract, an asterisk to multiply, and a forward slash to divide. Now every Excel formula will start with an equal sign. And I'll show you what I mean. If I click on cell A1, a simple formula would be equals 100 plus 10 and then if I press the enter the answer is displayed if I click on cell A1 we have A1 selected in our name box and in our formula bar we have 100 plus 10 as the formula and the answer displayed cell A2 equals 100 minus this time 10 press our enter and there we have the answer displayed 90 click on there cell A2 100 minus 10 cell A3 equals 9 multiplied this time so an asterisk by 3 enter answer in cell A3 27 click on there and there's our formula in the formula bar and cell A4 guess what we'll do a division so equals 9 forward slash 3 so 9 divided by 3 press the enter button answers 3 and again you see it in your formula bar now this time what I'm going to do is I'm going to add these four numbers together but I'm not going to do the formula myself this time I'm going to move up to the editing group and I'm going to click on auto sum and when I've hovered the mouse over auto sum you can read it says display the sum of the selected cells directly after the selected cells right okay so what that means is it's going to add up the four cells I've got above immediately above it so if I click on there and we have this effect around the four cells which is called a marquee effect and in cell C5 our formula equals sum so that means added together the total of all four cells and it's A1 through to A4 and you see it in our formula bar a little bit easier equals sum brackets A1 through to A4 so we're adding 110 90 27 and 3 and if we press our enter key there's our answer in A5 230 so that's straightforward enough but when we're moving cell to cell we can also do sums so if we have values in cell C2 45 and in D2 55 if I wanted to put a formula for these two and add them together I could use the auto sum but I could also put equals and this time if I point at C2 that's got the marquee effect use our plus sign and D2 so I'm adding C2 and D2 together press the enter button and there we have 100 try something slightly different 50 as a value in C4 and a 4 in D4 and this time 
I'm going to multiply them. So an E4 equals sign, select the cell I want to use, C4, select the mathematical operator, an asterisk to multiply, and then select the next cell to multiply it by D4. Press the enter button, 200. And lastly, I'm going to show you on this tutorial, I'm going to put a value of 76 and a value of 23. So E6, I'm going to do my formula, so it's going to equals, select my first value in C6, this time a forward slash to divide, select D6, there's our formula, C6 divided by D6, so 76 divided by 23, press the enter button, and it comes out at 3.304348. Now that actually is quite a few decimal points and if we want to get rid of decimal points or round things up or down up to the number group and then we've got decreased decimals increased decimals well let's decrease the decimals of this cell so click on there and we've got down to 3.3 .3. Thanks very much.